Okay, this is the stomach model, and in order on our list, the structures we have to identify first, gastroesophageal sphincter, going into the region. Cardiac region, fundus, going out of order in this one, pyloric, and then the rest of it, the body. Again inside the stomach, Tip up. here, the pyloric sphincter. And it touches your mandible. Okay. This area. Gosh. This is referred to as the lesser curvature, and this is the greater curvature. I went out of order on that, too. Inside the stomach, these ridges are referred to as rugae. Rugae. I don't know how it's pronounced. R U G A E. The muscle layers of the stomach. Could you not say it? Okay, first. Here. Is that showing up decent? Yep. Okay. Um, here, two. And also seen probably best here along the greater curvature. Mm -hmm. Longitudinal layer. Here. Here, circular layer, and then this cutout shows the oblique layer, and then finally, inside a break, this is a gastric pit leading into a gastric gland. Don't forget about the greater and lesser momentum to tell them. Oh yeah, the greater and lesser momentum, the list says they're supposed to be viewable on this model, but I talked to the professor and she said that she'll check, but she doesn't see them on this model either. But the lesser momentum would be coming this way, and about here you'd have that break to the greater momentum, which would be covering here. All right, that's it.